Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another video with today. We're doing on a charity box collection day number 14. Yes, we're already at number 14. And remember, I do have number 14 and then I have number 14.5. 14.5 is usually my, um, well, this time it's going to be my, my less better, like my worst locations, but they're not really that bad in this video. My better locations are, well, most of my better locations are going to be in my 14.5 video. In the summary, which will um, include like the total, my profit, breakdown, everything, will be at the end of the next video. So stay tuned for that. That will be coming out next Saturday, so make sure to subscribe and turn on the post notifications so you know how whenever that video goes live. But again, we are in number 14. Again, three week collection, 10 boxes. I am going to be pulling out a few boxes this time. Let you guys know about that because you know I'm trying to. Switch on a bad location for even better locations, you know how that works. Alright, so I do know that a lot of you guys, well, like, 40% or to 60% of you guys are not subscribed and you guys watch my videos, so it's like, just click the button, alright? Just click the button, also don't forget to um, smash that like button, smash the subscribe button, turn on the post notifications so you'll be notified whenever I upload another video. Comment down below, share the video. And that's hot for me. Let you guys know. Um, also, follow me on my social media. The link will be in the description Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Um, and the first part, uh, like the first two, two or three minutes, I just talked to you about my products I got this time. So, and then after the product, we'll be heading on into the actual collection. So, enjoy. All right, products, my products, products, products. So, as you can see, if you've been here uh, at my channel for a little bit, you know that um, these are all brand new cans besides these two. That, I've been doing this. I've been doing it for a long time, I can remember. And I do also do Hershey Nuggets Assorted. I forgot to buy those. And same thing with the Blow Pops. I forgot to buy those. Blow Pops were my first products I got like six, seven months ago when I first started my business. But now I added these M&M's as all these flavors. I got this, I got that. And I also got these. Um, the products you should put in your honest charity boxes. Um, the video, I'm gonna be making a part two to it since now I have all these new candies. So stay tuned for that video. Make sure you subscribe, like the video, and turn on the post notifications so you can notified whenever I upload that video or any other videos. And if you're wondering how I spent on just as much, um, I did spend seventy five dollars if I can get it on here on my receipt real quick, and these are all from BJ's. If you are wondering, there we go, seventy six dollars. Um, it's probably gonna be near a hundred once I. It's gonna be over a hundred once I get the blow pops and the Hershey nuggets assorted, because those are pretty expensive. But um, I'm kind of like building up inventory to have a thing. Not only building up, I just like my first. Try it's kind of like an investment, even though this is all from my capital money because I do have around 300 bucks, a little less, and my capital money for my business. So, you know, that's just how it is. So, I'll update you guys whenever the next thing happens. Well, you know, whenever the next product or whatever. Yes, real quick, I do eat my own product, and uh, now since they got all of these stuff, you already know what's going to go down. And I also did start selling candies at school. It doesn't do that much, but I do make around five, ten dollars, maybe sometimes, um, at school. So with all these new candy, hopefully it goes up a little bit. Maybe we we'll start making more money. We we'll just have to wait and see and stay tuned. I might make the whole video about that too, so stay tuned. So we'll hop right into the video. This is one of my locations called Jamaican Cafe Cuisine, and not going in my usual order. So you know, all my good locations will be all mixed up in the video. So I think it's a better thing. This is also my Gamal Machine location, as you can see right there. And all the box location, obviously. It's a little tiny restaurant. Mostly, it's takeouts. There's, like, a few tables there, too. But mostly, it's for takeouts. You can see the box there is pretty low. Um, So, we'll see how much money is inside. Okay, yeah, this is most of everything. All right, so right there, that was $13.62. A little bit better than it usually does, Um, uh, which is a good thing, obviously. So that's basically it. And can you guys give me a comment down below letting me if I should record uh like ten seconds after each location or should I just leave the money uh like to, or, should, or should I just add the money amount um right after I open the box up while I'm editing? Comment down below and let me know, cause I don't know. So 
Yeah, just do it. Alright, so this location is a pretty weird one. It does okay around ten dollars a month. It's called Past Pizzeria, but this is usually never anybody here and it's a really big lunch dinner little restaurant type of thing. My box is okay, so I did leave it here. Um, uh, obviously I left it here. There's also a triple head candy machine in this place that's not mine. So the competition is, you know, pretty big. But you know, all the cups are gone, and there's a, f uh, there's like half the chocolates are gone. So you know, the money inside should be a good amount. And right here, I have no idea what I'm doing. So yeah. Uh, Fifteen cents. That I did ten dollars. Fifteen cents. Good enough for me. Enough for me, for me to leave the box here another time. So hopefully it does more next time, but you know, we can only hope. But yeah, good enough, so I'll head on into the next location. Alright, right here we are heading on into a place called Lee's Nails and Tanning Spa. I had two other boxes here at two other stores. Both got pulled out, and there's a big huge rack with another like, play gumball machine thingy over there. Competition is pretty real. I might try to get an box in there. Um, you know, we'll see, and probably not, because I don't think it's going to do good. But here I head on into the nail salon, grab the box, and this is also another, another one of my gumball machine locations, so it did look pretty low. So, you know, that collection review is coming pretty soon. Don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe button to the post notifications. But yeah, um, I'm struggling with the door here, and then I head on out. Usually I end up dropping some candy too, but you know, didn't drop this time. All the lollipops are gone, and half the amount of chocolates are also gone. So, and also, don't forget to smash the subscribe button and like the video. Do all that good stuff, and now let's go see how much money is inside. Coins. This location has been here for like six weeks now because I haven't been able to collect it because they've been closed whenever I went there. So, this is a little sandwich sub shop, also. Um, I go grab the boxes right there on the corner. Not really the best location, but only location to let me do it. All the pups are gone. Half of my chocolates are also gone. This is one of my popular locations. I do have another popular location, as some of you guys know. But as sad to do this one, they always have a lot of theft rate. I decided to change the only lollipops on my place that do really bad in theft. I'll change all lollipops. Still do bad, I'm gonna pull it. So this one did only do like four bucks. And I will show you the clip after this. Not enough for me, and they did like have like all lollipops gone, so you know, someone's stealing it. And I'm pretty sure it's some employees, but you know, you never know. But there's only a few left, as you can see. I do end up pulling it was four dollars and fifty cents only, a lot of theft. So it's, you know, sad to say goodbye, but I do go places right after that. For these people, I did actually had to go back and tell them I'm gonna the boss. I do also have a little machine over here. It's a one head um. M and M machine though, so I'm just gonna tell them, and I'm gonna cut the audio right as soon as I start speaking, which should be right, right around. I just want you to let you know that I'm gonna take the box out and see what you're taking it out, okay, but I'll I'll leave the machine. There's going to be a place in video because I do have a lot more places and things, so stay tuned for that video. But I do go places right after I do because I don't want to go home with the box. I'm to go to the store. Walk to my place. It's right down. Okay. But this place, um, before um, I had it, they told me to get out. It was really real box. It sold out in its first week. And it had all the money in it. But they got shut down because of the past health inspection they had on um, <laughs> they had bugs in yeah so they got shut down now it's reopened under new management managing on my box there not in the best place in there like it's like right behind but right beside the seats where the waiting area is but it's right down there so i'm hoping it does do good i'll try to place it in a better area because it is a pretty big um buffet i'll try to show you a little bit of it Usually always packed. It was on the news too when I shut down for you know proving it. Or like Delaware movies. Part of it's right here you can see. I see my box. Yeah. Hopefully you let me. I'm good. I'm just gonna go refill the box and Thank you. Alright, I feel like this one. I'm gonna walk all the way back down. Yeah, most of the things gone. It's not really in the sight of an employee, so. 
You can see a little money in there, but let's just talk a little bit. What should we talk about? Um, so yeah, that last location that I, I did, I did just pull because it kept stealing. I still have my little candy machine there. I think I'm in it. it. Um, I went, took the box that I um, took the box, went over to the next door. Sports clips, which I uh, I tried before. He said the o- o- owner wasn't there. Come back later. Um, the owner still wasn't there unless that uh, girl was the owner. I asked him. He said yes. I put it up. Problem solved. Loose one box. Put it right back. So I don't want to go home with the box. You know, I'm trying to. Even, you know, you know bad ideas. Not go home. Alright, let's go this one. Let's go. So I do have like three or four on a box. Of fish, all right, yeah. Um, I'm gonna try to get in the sight of the employees a little bit more. And <laughs> so I want to stuff their trash in here. Pretty sure those are the ones who didn't pay for it. I'm gonna try to get in the sight of the owner. So that's theft, but I know those gonna pay off eventually. So let me put it up and do my thing. And he's looking good, looking good. And this is, um, if you guys are wondering how I put my, um, uh, my boxes, I usually put them like this for my, my regular, all my, all my, all my regular location, usually like this, um, exclude this thing I just had in my thing, so I thought I would put it there, um, bet my better location, I would stack up my lollipops, um, in a second row over here on this side and this side, uh, depending on the good, better location, but, um, this one still has not proved itself, so I'm gonna leave it like this for now, but we'll see. So the next video is, is gonna have more, uh, more of the end part, which I mean, like, t- I'm gonna break down, t- I'm gonna break down everything, tell you guys the profit, you know, how much money I spent on what, how much money I spent on all this crazy amount of product, you know, break down everything for you guys, so make sure you guys stay tuned for the next video. This video is mostly just me opening a box, t- me opening a box and telling you, how much money they were inside of them and the next video will start off with that but um the other half of the video will be about the end part and all that good stuff just stay tuned smash the subscribe button please do i i, I know you're watching this and half people are watching this and did not even subscribe just hit like you know it makes my day all right so, um smash the subscribe button turn the post notification and like the video comment down below um share the video if you guys want and subscribe if you want a piece of candy all right, see you guys in the next one. Peace, doses, whatever you want to say. All right, see you guys in the next one. Peace.